Hello everyone and welcome to this video, another in the Fight Night series brought to you by James from MySmarterHome.com. My Fight Night series of videos contain comparisons of popular smart devices and to make it more light-hearted I use a boxing match format. The two devices that are in today's ring are the Ecobee 3 and the Honeywell Lyric T5 smart thermostats. In this comparison I collect as many details as I can about each product and I then break down the details into shorter sections and these become my boxing rounds. This fight contains 8 rounds. After each round I tell you who in my opinion has won and at the end of the comparison I will declare an overall winner. So here we have photos of the Ecobee 3 and the Lyric. Now I don't want to tell you which of these thermostats that I, like, that I like the look of more because I think that the look of a product is something that is down to personal taste. What all my videos tend to focus on instead is the facts of the specifics. So let's go into round one. Let's bring the thermostats in and let's have a look at what some of the features are. So the first feature is who are they made by? The Ecobee 3 is made by Ecobee. Ecobee are a company that started a few years ago and they just make smart devices. Honeywell, obviously one of the biggest companies historically to make thermostats. They go back over a century in terms of making thermostats. So they're, they're a very well recognized name. Now in terms of when were these two devices first for sale? Ecobee 3, June 2015, so that makes it about just under two years old, whereas the Lyric T5 is was released in October 2016, so that's just over six months old. In terms of weight, the Ecobee 3 is slightly heavier at 1.4 pounds, whereas the Lyric T5 is just 12 ounces. Size, they are very, very similar. The Ecobee 3 is 4x4x0.9 4 by 4 by inches, whereas the Lyric is 4x4x1.2 4 by 4 by inches. So it's just slightly thicker than the Ecobee 3 is. Now in terms of price, there's a big difference here. The Ecobee 3 is $189.97 and the Lyric is $104.98. But of course the prices are subject to change. So just keep an eye on those if you do some further research. So at the end of round one, I think the clear winner there is the Lyric. It's younger, it's lighter, and it's a lot cheaper. So let's go into round two. Let's get the thermostats out and let's have a look at some of the features. Okay, so first of all, colors. Both of these are only available in one colour style. The Ecobee 3 is obviously black. The Lyric is also black and silver or grey. Materials, both of them are made from plastic. In terms of power, the Lyric requires your uh, power from your C wire on your system. Whereas the Ecobee 3 can have be powered either by the C wire on your system or by a PEK, which is a power extending kit, which actually comes with it. So let's move on in terms of looking at the screens. The Ecobee 3 has a color screen, screen and it is three and a half inches big. The Lyric is also got a three and a half inch screen, but it's not color. It just tends to be black and white. Next feature is all about the touch screens. Both of these are touch screens. The resolution of the screens, well the Ecobee 3 we know is 320 by 480 pixels, whereas I couldn't find anything about the resolution of the Lyric screen. So round two, I think it's the Ecobee 3 who won the design and power round. It's got more power options and it's got a color screen. Round three, the smart heating features. Let's get the thermostats in and let's have a look at what some of these features are. So the first one is all about the programming. 
um, both of these thermostats need to be manually programmed. There is the Nest thermostat that doesn't need to be programmed. It, it learns your own heating and cooling requirements without you needing to manually program it. But these two thermostats do require programming. Room sensors, the b 3, well known for using room sensors. The Lyric doesn't use room sensors. Room sensors, just to explain, are plastic buttons that you can place in different rooms around your house and they then communicate back to the thermostat wirelessly letting the thermostat know the temperature in that individual room and whether or not that individual room is occupied as well. Geofencing, both of these use geofencing. Geofencing is a capability of the thermostat to know if you are still at home and essentially if you leave home then it will turn down the system or, or shut down the system so that you're not heating or cooling an empty house and it does this it knows if you're at home by linking to your mobile to your smartphone and working out where you are the next smart heating feature is remote access this is a very very important one for people who are looking to buy a smart thermostat and both of these thermostats can be remotely accessed and we'll have a look at the apps and the requirements of this remote access in a while in this comparison. Energy saving, the ECOB3, ECOB believe that the ECOB3 can save you up to 23% per annum, per year on your heating and cooling bills. The Lyric says that it will save you energy but I couldn't find a specific figure from Honeywell about it. So there's a bit of a difference there. The Ecobee 3 in terms of forecasting gives you um, a forecast on the screen. I've got down here that it's seven days. I don't know that that's the case but you can see an out your local weather on the screen on the Ecobee whereas for the Lyric it only displays the outside temperature on its screen and then the app the Honeywell app will show you a local weather forecast as well. So round three for the smart heating features is going to be the Ecobee 3 again because of its use of room sensors and it has a local forecast which you can see on the thermostat screen itself. Round four, some more heating systems. So let's have a look at these. We've got gas, electric, oil and dual fuel. And just to say this, this of course is for 24 volt heating systems. So both the Ecobee and the Lyric can be used with gas systems. Both of them can be used with the electric systems. Both of them with oil systems. And the Ecobee 3 can be used with a dual fuel system. But the Lyric can't. So there's a the difference there. So at the end of round four. It's going to be the Ecobee 3. Very, very similar features, but the Ecobee 3, as I said, does do dual fuel. Right, so the second part of some, the heating systems. So the Ecobee 3, when you look at conventional type systems with furnaces, the Ecobee 3 can do two stages of heating and two stages of cooling, and their Lyric can do the same two stages of heating and two stages of cooling. If it's used with a heat pump, then the Ecobee can use four stages of heating and two of cooling, whereas the Lyric can only use up to three stages of heating and up to two stages of cooling. The Ecobee 3 you can use to manage a humidifier, whereas the Lyric, you can't use it to manage the heating systems. Sorry, the humidifier. Or, or a dehumidifier, in fact. So at the end of round five, no surprise, it's going to be the Ecobee 3 because it can cope with more heating stages with systems and it's compatible with other accessories such as a humidifier or a dehumidifier. 
Round six, this is our remote access section where we look at the apps that are required. So if you're using an iPhone or an iPad to um, control your device and the Ecobee 3 needs a version 9 or later of iOS where and the Lyric is the same, it requires version 9 or later of the iOS system. If you're using it with your Android phone such as your Galaxy phone or your Google Nexus or Google Pixel phone then the Ecobee 3 requires the version of Android that your phone or your smart tablet needs to be running is specific to the device so all you need to do there is sign into your Google account go on to Google Play and then it will tell you from your devices that it knows you have what version of Android that device needs to be running whereas the Lyric if you're using it with your Android phone or your smart tablet such as a Galaxy Tab then um, you're going to be needing version 4 or later of the Android system. Neither of these two um, thermostats have an app for Windows 10 mobile. The Lyric you cannot control via a browser whereas the Ecobee 3 you can actually control it via a browser and the advantages of controlling it via a browser is that if you've got like your Windows laptop at home or your Apple your MacBook Pro at home you can control the Ecobee 3 by going on to the by visiting the Ecobee website and by signing in and changing things there as well so that's a real advantage for the Ecobee 3 and for that reason it's going to win round six home automation sorry not home automation remote access round seven is home automation here we go so let's bring the thermostats in and let's have a look at the different features we've got here so first of all the first home automation system is Amazon Echo and both of these thermostats can work with the Echo system the next one is IF triple T if this then that and both of these systems, both of these thermostats can work within the I, 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 IF triple T um, web service. Both the Lyric and the Ecobee 3 also work with Apple HomeKit. Only the Ecobee 3 will work with the Wink system, and only the Ecobee 3 will work with the Samsung Smart Things home automation system. So round seven again, it's going to be the Echo B3 because it can, just can be used with more more home automation systems. On to our final round here. This is the reviews and the ratings. So let's get the thermostats out and let's have a look at the different features. So the first one here is overall ratings. So the overall rating of the Echo B3 is 4.4 out of five. The Lyric is 3.9 out of 5, so there's a big difference there that the, the Ecobee has a much better rating. Number of reviews that have been written, the Ecobee 3 has 3,500, which if we look at how long it's been for sale, that's about 152 per month, whereas the Lyric only has 139 reviews that have been written, which is about 23 per month, so again there's a big difference there more people are writing reviews many more reviews for the Ecobee 3 questions that have been asked and answered well Ecobee 3 623 whereas the Lyric is only 128 so again there's a big difference there this next one here percentage of five star ratings how many people when they rate the product have actually given it five stars for the Ecobee 3 80 percent of all people who have rated the product have given it given it five stars whereas for the Lyric it's only 50% of all people that have rated the product have given it five stars. The percentage of people that have only given it a one star for this we're looking for a low percent so of all the people that have rated the Ecobee 3 only 5% of them have given it one star whereas for the Lyric 14% of all the reviews have given it one star so unfortunately that's a higher percentage there for the Lyric in a category that it didn't want to be higher in. 
also this is another area which is subject to change as more reviews have been written as more questions are answered so again just bear that in mind when you're doing more research so in terms of round eight well the clear winner again is going to be the Ecobee 3 it's got uh, more reviews, it's got more questions that have been answered, it's got a higher rating of five stars and a lower rating of one star. So in that respect, it's a clear winner. Overall, it's going to be, the overall winner is the b 3. When you look at all the specifications, the very clear winner is the b 3, but it is almost twice the price. Now, Having gone through the specifications, I would spend the extra money buying the E3, sorry, the Ecobee 3, over the Lyric, but would you? Thank you for watching these, this video.